loveliness, cleanliness, creativeness come from godliness. Three grains of garlic, let's squeeze it. I'm creating a recipe which didn't belong to me. I find it by someone. So let's go into the mix. Some of my flavor sauce, just a touch, just a very touch. Some lemon, some olive oil, and the main thing, some Turkish yogurt. This is a dip I'm making, right? Now, I went by my friend the other day, and he and his wife, they was cooking some duck. Duck is a thing I didn't eat for the last, first time, one time I tasted duck was 46 years ago. 46 years ago, you can imagine how long. But when he told me he was cooking this duck, I was there, so I said, I will eat something. I didn't duck the duck, because the duck could fly, you know? And then a touch of salt. Now what I'm doing there, all these things I put there, that's what is the item for what I ate when they told me. I don't really know how much, how much, so I'm creating it. Just trying to find the taste. I remember the taste, but it might not be the same taste. I will create it in a little different taste, a little more lemon. Stir it up, stir it up. I ain't get yet a little more yogurt. Stir it up, stir it up. It ain't ready yet. Touch it. Let me see. I don't think it's ready yet. Stir it up. Stir it up. A little more olive oil. Stir it up. Stir it up. Stir it up. Let me see if you're ready. A little more salt. Now I think it's ready. Stir it up. Stir it up. Touch it now. It's ready? Yes. And the reason why I'm making this recipe now is to eat with this. This is some overnight food. Right? I made it yesterday and that was the last what we made. So I decided to take some of Countryman organic small tomato and put it in the plate. That's great. And obviously, I'll put some of that, the main item, right at that. And that. <laughs> and it's nice. So in the meanwhile, I say I'm going to bake a cake. Like Mandrake. You know Mandrake? You love cake. Now, in that blue bowl there, I have four eggs, not like Mr. Pegs, four eggs. And I just put in a half cup of sugar. Half is white, half is brown, but it's a half cup, so which means it's quarter quarter. <laughs> yeah, stir it up, stir it up. Yes. And then I put a cup of flour, bacon flour, special bacon flour. And in that flour there, I have a spoon, a tablespoon of cinnamon and a teaspoon of nutmeg. All come from the land of spice, Grenada. Ha ha ha. Stir it up. Stir it up. Yes. What next? Ah. On top there, I got some fresh ginger. Put it in. And then that's the carrot. That's the base. They could call it a carrot cake. It's not fake. It's a carrot cake. It's just improvisation, you know, mixtation with pure meditation, you know, it's so it go, <laughs> it's not mango, it's so it go, <laughs> yes, stir it up, stir it up, as Bob Mali say, stir it up, you know what I mean, and then I'm going to put in some fruits, dry fruits, some of that fruits there is three different fruits, some red cherry, some green cherry, and some black raisins, do it, stir it up, stir it up, stir it up, you know what I mean? What next? Something else? Oh, it's coming. Some polo rum. A touch of polo rum. Yes, that way I call improvisation, vibration, meditation. <laughs> I love it. Yes, my dear people. And because of the rum, it gets a little bit wet, so I have to put some sweet potato. A piece of sweet potato. Stir it up. Stir it up. Stir it up. What next? The pan? Go ahead and scrape it out. Stop stirring it up. Scrape it out. Scrape it out like a Guinness stout. Scrape it out. Scrape it very proper enough you know, so nobody can lick it. I remember my grandmother when she doing that. She can scrape it out so good enough you know, that we had to get a lick off, you know what I mean? But no licking off. And shake it up. Shake before using your medicine. Put it in, in the stove. And I will put it on 200, as the stove say, and watch it till it's ready. About 45 minutes. And in the meanwhile, I say let me make a fruit punch. 
I had some um, carrot and some beet juice there that I already made it I mean, in the fridge and that's something I juice it there so I get just the liquid and put some banana and that's it and that will be very nice I drink it already it nice twice because I will drink it twice put a small straw big straw is not good you drink it too fast you know like if you have gas you can't drink it fast like if you will get gas sip it touch it yes it good nice that's good now let me get some more cleanliness is close to godliness so you know my dear people a lot of people i see them all over the world on youtube this that and the cooking in dirty place i decide before i go and cook some fresh food today let me clean up behind my stove make sure it's clean and proper and then after i clean it i'll put it back and i'm going to cook some fresh food but i will not show you how i cook the food eh? I'll tell you why. Today's a special video. I just, you know what I mean? It's just a vibe. I wanted to show you the Turkish dip for the duck. You know? And my friend make this duck, you know? And when I see that duck, I couldn't dog the duck. Because you know why? I just only think I could fly and swim. So if it's a bird, I will touch a piece. Now and again. And if it's a fish, I will touch a piece. Because the fish could swim, the duck could fly. Rice and peas. And you see, and then I cook a piece of sweet potato with a normal piece of potato. Pow! You see what I'm saying there? The reason why I cook some fresh food. This Turkish dip that I, I make the, the talk, I'll call it dip for the duck. <laughs> so it was so nice. I said, let me take some fresh food this time, you know, and then use that same thing from the fridge that I had it yesterday. Because that was very nice, you know. Malino, everybody know. Which you like for yourself? Pokey, everybody know. This is just a lyrics, no? Uh, who reach the line? Who know it, know it? Who see it, see it? Who hear it, hear it? Who understand it, understand it? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> yes. Put some of the dip now. The dog dip. I'll give you a name, you know? I'll call it a dog dip. Because that dog dip, you better have some big lip <laughs> to dip. My dear people, I love all of 